Grandpa Walton was played by actor Will Gear, who was born William Aguirre in Frankfurt, Indiana, to a teacher, and a postal worker. Will admired his grandfather, a man who said hello to trees by their Latin names and who had used what he brought back to Indiana from the California Gold Rush to build Frankfurt's first opera house. Will pursued a college major in botany, from Chicago through a master's degree at Columbia, but ultimately gave in to his need to perform. Starting with touring company tent shows and riverboats, his six-decade career included Broadway, movies, television, many Shakespeare roles, one-man performances as Walt Whitman and Mark Twain. His best-known role was his last, Zebulon Walton, grandpa in the long-running television series The Waltons. Less well-known was his role as a folk singer, he toured U.S. government work camps in the 1930s, singing with Woody Guthrie and Burl Ives. Gear later became a vegetarian. He had the unusual hobby of raising all the plants mentioned in the works of Shakespeare. He was a member of Orson Welles and John Houseman's Project 8 and Indy One Theatre Company, sponsored by the Federal Theatre Project. He claimed that he was cast as slim in the Broadway play version of John Steinbeck's Of Mice and Men by Steinbeck himself because he showed up to the audition in blue jeans and Steinbeck thought he looked the part. Steinbeck was sitting outside the stage door on a chair when he made the decision as Gear filed past him. Gear was briefly considered for the part of Amos McCoy for the real McCoy's when original choice, Walter Brennan, was unavailable.